Welcome back, everybody, and thanks for joining again. You're probably wondering to yourself, what the heck was that intro all about? Well, once I show you what I would like to share with you today, you might be able to get it. But uh, let's dive right into it, and uh, let me show you what uh, showed up in the mail today. <laughs> This will be my first time actually seeing it in in person and getting a first-hand experience of uh, how well these are made. Uh, the packaging is pretty cool. So if anybody that doesn't know whose signature that is, that's Peter McKinnon. And down underneath here is uh, these two CNCs with the compass is uh, clocks and colors and uh, I'm pretty excited. So let's check it out. So you see here clocks and colors and there the beauty is. I'm so excited about this. This is this looks really nice. Let's check it out. Wow it's uh, it's pretty heavy. That's that's pretty neat. That's very well made. Excuse the uh, working hands. They're not modeling hands, but uh, hopefully you're looking at the ring and not my hands. So the, the quality is amazing. So these are all handmade by Clocks and Colors, and Peter McKinnon does work with them in collaboration with uh, them to make these rings and these are his designs and uh, they bring it to life. Oh, look at that. So each one is numbered, as you can see. That's awesome. With uh, Peter's signature inside there and the CNC for clocks and colors. So apparently I'm the 925th person that has purchased this ring. So not very special. I knew a lot of people have bought these, but again, I wanted to uh, share my experience with you in actually getting one of these. So just so you know, this was the biggest size that I could get off the Clocks and Colors website, which was a, a 14, I believe. And I have beat big meat hooks, so I'm curious to see what uh, finger this is going to fit. Um, not the pinky. Uh, it's loose there. Uh, yeah, not even going to try there. Oh, it's pretty good there. Uh, a little bit tight. Let's try the other hand. Same thing. Pretty loose. Nope. And yeah, it's about the same there. So that fits. That's nice. And that's comfortable. That's very comfortable. That feels really nice. Again, it's um, it's a tad bit on the tight side for me. But again, this was the biggest uh, that they had on their site. So if any advice that I maybe had for Clocks and Colors is uh, maybe getting some bigger sizes for people with hands the size of mine. But uh, I could have went smaller, I guess, and went with a pinky uh, a ring but that would be pretty huge for a pinky ring but I like it I'm very impressed the quality of this is just amazing and it feels really good so there you have it I wanted to share this with you and uh, show off this ring and also just uh, let you know about uh, clocks and colors and the things that Peter McKinnon is doing in collaboration with others he does have a video that he had an interview with the owner of Clocks and Colors. Uh, so you can actually see that on his site and head over to Peter McKinnon's site to see a lot more amazing stuff. And mountains are my thing. Uh, I love the mountains and uh, it's pretty cool that he's got the mountains on there. 
And also in the packaging, which was pretty cool, and I didn't expect, is they sent some stickers too. So I got a Peter McKinnon sticker there. Got a Clocks and Colors. This is pretty cool. And of course, Peter's truck. That's, that's nice. My favorite one of all is this one. I really like this one. This is a nice one. So yeah, there you have it. I'm excited. I think these are amazing. They turned out really good. Uh, so head on over to their site. Head over to Peter's site. Uh, check out his videos. Check out the interview that he had with the Clocks and Colors owner. And yeah, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, leave your comments, all that jazz below. Um, I'll leave some links and stuff in the description to uh, Peter and to Clocks and Colors as well. But definitely worth it. And uh, it feels really good. Definitely. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed it and uh, see you soon.